Its origin can be traced all the way back to ancient Greece. Rumor has it it was served at the very first Olympic Games in 776 BC. I'm talking, of course, of cheesecake. In this video, I'm going to be making cup cheesecakes. Cup cheesecakes. Ingredients include the crust, three and a half cups of graham cracker crumbs. Two thirds cup of melted butter, a half a cup of granulated sugar, a half teaspoon of salt, the cheesecake. It's important to note that all ingredients are at room temperature. Don't refrigerate any ingredients. Two cream cheese packages at room temperature. A half cup of granulated sugar. A quarter cup of sour cream at room temperature. One teaspoon of vanilla. Two eggs at room temperature. One jar of strawberry topping. Special equipment. You can use a hammer, or you can use a food processor. The crust. Preheat your oven to 350 degrees. To make the crust, first you will need some crushed graham crackers. I'm going to show you two ways to crush the crackers. One way is with a hammer and the other is with a food processor. The hammer.
Remove the crackers from the box and place them into a larger food preparation bag. With all the crackers in the food prep bag, place the second bag upside down over the first. Squeeze the air out of the bag. Proceed to crust the graham crackers. Try to crust the crackers down to the smallest crumbs you can. The food processor method. Fill the food processor with graham crackers. If you don't think you have enough crumbs, you can add more crackers and turn the machine on again. When you think you have enough graham cracker crumbs, enter the machine into a bowl. Spray a muffin tin with cooking spray.
place muffin liners into the muffin tins. When complete, place the muffin tin aside. In a mixing bowl, add three and a half cups of graham cracker crumbs. Add two thirds cup of melted butter. Add a half a cup of granulated sugar. Add a teaspoon of salt. Mix the contents until all the ingredients have blended together. Spoon in some graham cracker mixture into the first tin. Using something sturdy, press down into the muffin tin to flatten the bottom. Spoon in some more graham cracker crust. Using your hand, press the crust against the side of the tin. Repeat the process until the entire well has a crust. Be careful not to add too much crust. The more crust you add, the harder it will be when finished. Repeat the process for all six muffin wells. Bake the graham cracker crust for about 8 to 10 minutes. When time is up, remove the muffin tin from the oven. Put the muffin tin aside. It must cool back to room temperature before you can do anything else with it. The Cheesecake
Put two bars of cream cheese into a mixing bowl. Make sure they are at room temperature. Add one quarter cup of sour cream to the bowl. Add one teaspoon of vanilla flavoring. Add one half cup of sugar. Add the strawberry topping. The amount is to taste, plus or minus to your liking. Add one egg at room temperature. Mix the ingredients until blended. When the ingredients are properly mixed, add the second egg. Make sure the egg is at room temperature. It's important that the two eggs are added separately. Continue mixing. Spoon the cheesecake mixture into the muffin tin. Careful not to overflow the muffin wells. Cheesecake needs to be what is called boiled bake. Take a large baking dish, one that can hold the muffin tin, and add water. Place the muffin tin into the water in the baking dish.
Bake in the oven for 45 minutes. It's important to keep an eye on the cheesecake. Cooking times may vary. The cheesecake should start to stiffen around the edge first. Overbaking will cause cracking. When time is up, remove the cheesecake from the oven. Allow the cheesecake to return to room temperature. When the cheesecake cools to room temperature, remove it from the baking dish. Put the cheesecake in the fridge overnight. Do not go directly from the oven to the fridge. Allow the cheesecake to cool first. The following day, remove the cheesecake from the fridge. Remove the cup cheesecakes from the muffin tin. Remove the cupcake liners. And enjoy.